Icon swaps could be released very soon in FIFA 22 Ultimate Team. In this video, we are going to be discussing when are we most likely going to be seeing this because it is going to be having an impact on the market, not only on icon prices, but in general, there might be some more people playing FIFA, trying to grind these objectives. There might be some selling of different cards if some of these icons are really accessible, etc. So there's definitely going to be fluctuations on the market according to this, especially for icons. So it's definitely something we do you want to be aware of and also it's just something fun that we want to come in revitalize ultimate team a little bit it's getting maybe the adidas promo wasn't the greatest most interesting promo so it's definitely in our best interest to know when this could potentially be coming the sooner the better for most of us i do believe so if we take a look right now we do have this adidas promo and i do believe from the way that ea sports have pretty much been treating this whole promo you can see here on the right hand side adidas numbers up 11 special adidas numbers up items are available in fit 22 for one day and 20 hours so that is going to be expiring exactly friday 6 p.m uk time now there could be a team two there definitely could be a team two and the reason i'm talking about what is happening this friday is because some people are saying icon swaps could come as soon as this Friday. Now, I'm not too sure if it would. I do think that if the Adidas promo is going to be finishing, then there is a possibility for icon swaps to be released. But usually we see this at the end of the season. It doesn't necessarily have to be at the end of this season, but we can see here that season two currently is going to be ending in 35 days now if you actually take a look at the calendar that would actually mean that we aren't going to be having icon subs for a while that is going to be i believe around december 22nd now i do think that december 22nd is quite far out uh, last year if you take a look when we had it we actually had it on december 11th so we had it a little bit earlier so i'm thinking it might be somewhere in between i do think that there could be some time during black friday black friday is on the 26th of november on a friday maybe sometime during then i mean now wouldn't be the worst time because what ea sports could do is relief release half of the token tokens so if half of the tokens say 12 tokens or however many tokens yeah are going to do this year 10 tokens say 10 tokens are available for one month for these 35 days that wouldn't be a bad idea at all so i do think the possibility is there you do also need to keep in mind what is actually in the code so it does need to be in the code now it is quite difficult the code is extremely lengthy i did comment it i replied to a comment somebody requested this you guys can uh, request again i should be able to comment this down below so there is very, very many, of course, different things mentioned here. So if I just search for icon, you can see here that this is a new kit that was added into the store. So that's not exactly an icon. Here we've got a loan base icon. So isn't really to do with icon swaps, but I'm not too sure if we go through here. I mean, there's a base icon pack here. So that could potentially be used base or mid icon pack, base or prime icon pack. So I'm guessing EA already have sort of the infrastructure. They have everything set up. We've got a uh, 89 plus mid icon pack. I'm not saying that this is anything new. This is so certainly probably been in here since the start of FIFA, FIFA 20, FIFA 22. I'm just searching to sort of see if icon swaps was to be released this Friday, is everything necessary released, added into the packs and I it, it added into the code. And I think there is player picks, remember, don't necessarily need to be added to the code. So I do think that it does look like we do. We have pretty much the foundation, the setup for there to be icon swaps potentially this Friday. Now, the only scenario I see that happening is if we don't see a team two and we don't see any other promo. I did tweet something out. You guys said, uh, I said, do you think there'll be any a promo or any content this Friday in foot 22? People said, yes, of course, a new promo. So that could potentially be Road to the Knockout, something like that to do with Champions League cards. Some people have been suggesting headliners. I think that's a bit too early for that. I don't think we're going to be seeing headliners that soon. And um, then some people said, yes, Adidas Team 2. And then some people also said, no, there is going to be a break. If there is going to be a break, then Icon Swaps, in my opinion, more realistically, is going to be pushed further down. Now, potentially, sometimes it's been on Mondays. Potentially, it could be the 22nd of November. 29th of November it's really going to be depending if EA Sports want to bring it forward or if they are going to be waiting until the end of season two and they're going to be waiting all the way until pretty much maybe Friday the 24th or even December Monday the 27th to bring us icon swaps one I do think that would be quite late 
I am hopefully looking to see this a little bit sooner, like I said, to bring some life a little bit to Ultimate Team, because right now it's a little bit slump after we did get that uh, Adidas promo wasn't too impressive. If we look at what sort of cards could make it in, I've just went on Footbin here, some base icons that I've been taking a look at. I think Cafu could be interesting. A lot of people, I think I've been talking about him. We'd actually hover over here and we can see the card. Cafu would be quite interesting. Uh, Butchagreno, I think, would be pretty good. Cassias just at the start would be nice, I think, just for a couple tokens. A lot of people would want to get this he's one icon that i can actually say that i've watched and i've seen play in real life so he could be amazing very a lot of sentimental value i think for a lot of people zola maybe dalglish we sort of see the same names i believe like dalglish sort of like puskas eto are dreamed about to sort of be the end goal around 1.5 million coins but that would of course have to be 12 tokens earned sort of this month, let's say in season two perhaps, and then another 12 tokens earned in the next season. So it does pretty much seem that EA could be doing it this Friday. I think it does line up there for the first tokens to be now, and then the next ones could be in season three. When season three starts, the new tokens could come out. We're going to have to see, but in my opinion, I think it's more realistically to be during Black Friday or sometime after Black Friday. And for the content this Friday, I think we're either not going to get anything. EA have added in one current team of the week pack and also a double 81 plus upgrade pack. I think EA Sports could very easily just release this on Friday and call it a day. There might be some marketing. Uh, Jake tweeted out this. There could be some marketing. It's a little bit of a blurry image, but pre-Black Friday, I'm not sure exactly if we saw FIFA 20, FIFA 21 record breaker cards. I'm not sure if this was released a couple days before Black Friday or if it was actually released on Black Friday. I don't exactly remember now, but this was definitely released and this was sort of like building up the hype for Black Friday. So there could potentially be something already, some sort of mini pre Black Friday content drop to hype everyone up, or it could actually be Adidas Team 2, or it could be some sort of other promo. But I think more realistically is going to be this content is going to be dropping this content is going to be dropping the one current team of the week pack the double 81 upgrade and then i do believe black friday is going to be starting on the 26th and i think around then we could potentially see icon swaps icon swaps one hopefully is going to be released but let me know down in the comments below what you guys think thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you next time